Raquel again and we are back in the kitchen and today it's cold outside so what does that mean chicken pot pie time so today I'm gonna walk you through how to make my chicken pot pie this recipe is taken from the pioneer woman from the Food Network but I do make some modifications to it to make it super quick and super easy so if you want to see how I make my chicken pot pie dish stick with me and I'll be right back in my pot, I have about a half an onion and about three to four cloves of garlic that I've chopped up finely and I am sauteing in one stick of butter. We're going to saute the onions and garlic until they're translucent. To this mixture, we're gonna go ahead and add one package of frozen vegetables. This includes peas and green beans and carrots and corn. And we're just gonna put it in frozen and coat this uh, vegetable mixture with our onions and garlic and butter. After the vegetables, we're going to add cooked shredded chicken thighs to the mixture. After the chicken thighs, we're going to add about a fourth of a cup of flour. And after our flour, we're going to add a teaspoon of chicken bouillon. It's just going to enrich the chicken flavor in our pot pie. We're then, after the chicken bouillon, going to add about two cups of chicken broth that we just used. It's basically the water we use from boiling our chicken thighs. And then after the chicken broth, we're gonna add one cup of cream. This is the sauce that makes it all come together and makes it ooey gooey and creamy. To the cream, we're gonna go ahead and salt our pot pie um, and season it. So I've added here salt, pepper, and thyme. Again, so salt and season to your taste. And then we're gonna pour all of this yummy goodness into a deep pie pan and top it with puff pastry. That is the shortcut. Um, the original recipe calls for you making your own thyme crust and I didn't have time today. So I grabbed a piece of puff pastry, which I had in the freezer and put this on there, not anything pretty, and cut four slits in the top of it to uh, let air escape. And then I brushed the top of it with egg wash. That's gonna be one egg with mixed with a little bit of water and whisked together and brushed on top. And that is what makes the crust come out so beautiful at the end. And that's our pot pie. Well, that's our chicken pot pie. So you're gonna go ahead and bake the chicken pot pie for 30 minutes in an oven at 400 degrees. And once you take it out, let it sit for about 10 minutes and then it's ready to serve. If you want some side dish ideas, this would be great with a piece of French bread or a nice side salad. So if you make this dish, please feel free to tag me on your video or your photo. And if you wanna continue seeing more videos like this from me, don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, guys, you guys take care. Bye-bye.